Hey everyone, welcome to Practically. We bring learning life. Welcome back to the CSS hack series. Today I'm going to show you how to apply glass effect in CSS with the help of CSS backdrop filter property. Let's check it out. Okay, so this is one of the HTML file, okay, which contains one division tag here. In this division tag, we assign class name as container glass. And this HTML file is linked with one style file, which is here. Okay. If you see the output of this HTML file, this is the normal output of the HTML file without any glass effect. So our goal is to glass our so our goal is to create a glass effect on this screen, on this web page. Okay, so go back to the code. And here we have to write this code inside this CSS file. Okay, this CSS file is linked with this HTML file in this header section here so the class name is class class name is so the class name is container glass so we have to select this class name using dot class selector okay so dot container first create the height and first create the width and height of the glass effect that which we are creating so first create the height and width of the glass effect which we are creating and we need to set the margin also okay so first write the width as 500 pixel and height as 300 pixel you can type any random values okay so depending upon your choice now let's set the margin margin as 200 pixels and auto okay so this is fine now create the glass effect dot glass okay here we have to write the code for glass effect so first write the background okay then linear gradient yeah we got it linear gradient and set the degree as 135 degree okay then write the color effects here in the form of r g b okay red green and blue okay so r g b okay a then 255 255 and 255 so likely we apply we want to apply the gray color okay 0 0.1 light transparent okay then give comma then again write r g g b a pass the same value 255 comma 255 comma 255 comma 0 0.1 okay now we are going to use the backdrop filter property okay backdrop filter property and right here as we want to make it blur okay blur as we pass the 10 pixel value okay so we want to apply the blur effect now write the same code for this web kit okay and pass the same value as 10 pixel now set the border radius to make the edges round okay so border radius as 20 pixels slightly round okay then set the border as well border uh, one pixel one pixel width of the border solid style border and the color as give rgba same color okay now save this file go back to the web browser okay there is no glass effect yet now refresh this one and see we got the glass effect okay this is how with the help of css we can apply the glass effect to any web page so i hope you find this video very helpful okay to learn more such amazing css hacks download the practical app and register for a free trial i will see you in the next video with a new hack thank you bring learning alive practically